everybody, welcome to my muscle function video series. My name is Becky and today we'll be going over the palmaris longus muscle. We'll be going over its location which includes the origin, that's the starting point, the insertion which is the ending point, and then I'll give you the function of this particular muscle and then I'll finally provide you an exercise so you know how to strengthen this muscle. So let's start off with the location so we know exactly where we're talking about and then we'll move on from there. So the palmaris longus muscle is originated on the medial epicondyle of the humerus, which is pretty much the knuckle part of the humerus closest to the elbow joint. Medial meaning middle or closest to the middle, okay? So it would be right in here, that is the origin of it. And then it inserts onto the palmar aponeurosis of the second through the fifth finger okay so if the, this muscle runs from that medial epicondyle of the humerus right here okay and then runs all the way down and connects to that palmar aponeurosis which is like a fascia or a connective tissue inside of on your hand on the palm of your hand and that all connects to the second through the fifth finger, okay? So, uh, now that we know the location of it, I'm gonna provide you a photo so you know exactly what I'm talking about and where I'm talking about so there's no confusion. So here's a photo of the palmaris longus muscle. Okay, so now that you know where this muscle is, now we can apply its function. So the function of the palmaris longus muscle is to flex the wrist, okay, pretty much right in here, okay. This muscle also tenses that fascia area or your palm, okay, like so. So if your fingers were to come together and kind of grasp, if you're going to grasp something, okay, that's what that does, okay, as you can see there. Okay, now in some people this muscle is absent, so it in one or both arms, okay, it could be one or the other or both. Uh, a way, a cool way of testing this out, you can take your hand, okay, and touch your pinky and your thumb, okay, and flex the wrist a little bit, okay. Now as you can see, this area right here, that is the palmaris longus muscle, okay? Now in some people, that muscle is absent as for what I read, I guess. Um, so, that's just a cool way of testing to see if you have it in one or both arms or if you are absent in both or one, uh, either or, something neat that you can try right here during the video. So, now that we know the function and whether or not you have one, um, now we can move on to its, the exercise. So the exercises can be pretty much anything related with wrist flexion. Okay, so you're looking at any exercise or movement that's going to help with wrist flexion. Okay, and you can use any type of uh, exercise equipment, dumbbells, bands, cables, uh, just a plain old weight. Um, it really doesn't matter just as long, you know, as long as you're getting that wrist flexion in, okay? So I'm going to provide you an, an example of what you can use or what it should look like so you know how to do it. So here it is. much for watching the video everybody I hope you all enjoyed it if you did hit the like button pass it on with a share with a friend that may find interest in it or may use it in their own personal life or their own training or anything um, stay tuned for the next week if you haven't viewed my other videos there are more videos uh, on my youtube channel Becky Fiddler so I hope everybody has a great and productive week, and I will see you all next week. See you guys later.